All right. So again, to make you feel at home, uh, let me go ahead and grab this right here. Oh, it's hot. Oh, here we're gonna go. Let's see where we're gonna go. Where we go? He shoots. Oh, I missed again. Dang it! Another stain on the wall. I've got another video after this to do, but that's okay. Um, I'm willing to do anything to continue with this Japanese class. Anyway, oh my word, it's like love in a in a mug. So, uh, chapter 12, 4, we've got uh, Shunkashu to. So, Japanese, they love to put four characters together. And they make all these different sayings, uh, like Iseki Nicho, which means literally one rock, two, two birds. What does that mean? Two birds with one stone, right? Iseki Nicho. Uh, you already know Iseki and you know Ni, you just don't know Cho yet, which is uh, bird, Iseki Nicho. This one is shung, ka, shu, to. That's the onyomi for these different seasons. Well, we combine them together. Shung, ka, shu, to. That means all four seasons of the year. But the way that we call these um, normally, haru, which is spring, natsu, which is summer, aki, which is fall, fuyu, which is winter. So let's say them together, haru, natsu, aki, fuyu. So it took me a while to kind of imagine this, but haru has the sun low, so the sun is just kind of rising from winter. Natsu, it looks like the sun is like over everything, like, bah, like destroying it. Aki, you can see oh, something like a tree here being on fire. So it's kind of like the leaves changing. And then Fuyu looks kind of like snow in a way to me. So Haru, Natsu, Aki, Fuyu. That's how I kind of rem remind, uh, remember those. Also, we have Sengetsu. Sengetsu, we learn with Senshu. Sen means before. And Getsu means month. So this means last month, right? Sengetsu wa February desu ka ne? Sengetsu wa nigatsu. Nigatsu datta. Kongetsu, kon meaning this. Getsu meaning month. So kongetsu is this month. Kongetsu. Daigetsu, daigetsu, dai meaning next. Getsu meaning month. So daigetsu is next month, right? Saigo ni wa mai, well we don't say mai, we say mai shu for every week, but for month we say mai tsuki, mai tsuki every month. Mai tsuki. So let's say these together. No, that's the kunyomi, right? Sometimes with Japanese they will just put the kunyomi in just to frustrate you, to make your life a living hell, from which you can never emerge, even if you try, well, anyway. Sengetsu, kongetsu, daigetsu, maitsuki. Let's try it with weeks. Senshu, konshu, daishu, maishu. So you're just exchanging out week for month, right? So senshu last week, konshu this week, daishu next week, sengetsu last month, kongetsu this month, daigetsu next month, maitsuki every month. Saigo ni wa daiji. Daiji means important. And this is in the phrase o daiji ni, like treat yourself importantly. So daiji na, it's a na adjective. And then finally we come to this verb, gambaru. There's just no way to explain this in, Japan, in English at all. Gambaru, ma, gambaru means to do your best. It means, there's no way to explain it in Japanese. Like, gambaru is not just like do your best, but it also has the feeling of like just put yourself out there 100%. And so, well, gambarimasu means like I'm gonna do my best. 
And it's a word that's like universally respected in Japanese. There's no other way to put it. But like, ganbarimasu. Like if someone says to you, now go, ma, kore chanto yatte kudesai, ganbarimasu. And then the person will go, hmm, iya, ii kiai da na. So they'll say like, you know, oh, you need to do this right, whatever. And he's like, I'll do my best. And then they go, oh, well, you got good spirit. So ganbarimasu, I'll do my best. And you also hear, ganbatte ne, ganbatte ne. So this is not a do drop verb. It, it turns to the little tsu with te, gambatte. So you'll hear that a lot in uh, anime. Gambatte kudasai! Or gambatte! In gambatte, you'll hear the like the high school girls, uh, gambatte kudasai! And that means do your best, right? And so gambaru is one of those words, it literally means to stick your head out. Uh, haru means to like, I don't know, to like put your head out. And gang is your face. Gambaru. So, uh, ganbaru is a very important word. If anyone asks you to do anything, you say, ganbarimasu, and then they go, okay, he's, he's going to do it right. He's going to do it right. Okay, so, you turn to page 251. Uh, I don't know why they have tournamento. Tournamento. Um, they've got the bumpo, the grammar for na. Na is really easy. Like, if you have an important match, you know, daiji na shiai. Yume na hito. Kire na onna. So with a na adjective, you have to put a na in between the adjective and the noun as much as the e in an e adjective automatically appears. So, atarashi joho, like new news, right? Or, um, furui kuruma, an old car, right? The e automatically appears with this, shizuka na kyoshitsu, a quiet classroom. So the na has to be put between shizuka na kyoshitsu, okay? Um, so that also. They talk about uh, spring break, and I think one of the reasons why for Haruyasumi, a lot of college or a lot of high school and college students enjoy the fact that they're going to get an early Haruyasumi because Haruyasumi is the changing of the grades. So they go from ninth grade to tenth grade or whatever, and so because of that, unlike Natsuyasumi and Fuyuyasumi, they don't have. Um, they don't have take-home homework because their teacher is leaving and they're going to get a new teacher next year. So they basically have been given no work. Now, they've there are a lot of schools that have been given online work, but I think, you know, since the kids already know they're going to pass anyway, a lot of the kids who don't work hard aren't going to do it. I mean, they're not going to show up back to school again, so what are they, what's going to happen to them? Nothing. They're going to get passed. Um... Natsu Yasumi and Fuyu Yasumi, on the other hand, you get a big, thick pack, even from first grade, that you usually have to write a diary every day, and you have to do packets of uh, math and stuff like that, so it's, it's a lot of work. All right, so what I'd like you to do for today, which is mm, the 23rd, Monday, that is to do um, 252 A and B. Put those adjectives and uh, ask those adjectives. And again, see if you can get on chat with somebody and say, I mean, it's like the, the fourth or fifth question you get asked from someone you know. Like, just kidding, that's not true. Um, Niban. Kirai na tabemono. You know what that one is. Number three, Skina kuruma. Watashi no skina kuruma wa Nissan no skyline des. Let's see, Skina hon. Watashi no skina hon wa ne. Watashi no skiwa hon no hon wa. Do da ro. Nani ya ro. Ma manga to yeba. If you're saying manga, uh, dokaben, ma yakyu no dokaben ga suki desu. 
えー、と普通の本、はあ、普通の本だったらどうだろうな、うん、まあ1984ジョージ・オイワールの1984が好きですね好きな本ですえっ、ー、と Let's see here then B you match the adjectives with the person just practice that I don't want to get into to C because that's more of a class exercise So anyway, do your best, enjoy your time off, but get your work done. 頑張ってください。頑張ってください。